Okay, first off, talk about the process. And a lot of athletes like the recruiting process. A lot don't because they feel there's too much pressure. For you, you took some visits and such. Was it fun? Yes, overall it was really fun. I liked the long trips to Illinois and all the other states. So it was fun, but yeah, a lot of stress and not all the coaches were really nice, but yeah. Yeah. Well, talk about that because a lot of athletes don't know that when they go in what it's like. So what was it like for you? It was actually really difficult because I'm not a people person. So getting asked a bunch of questions and everything and getting put on the spot with scholarships and all that stuff and wanting them to, wanting me to sign them then then there. It was really hard to tell them no and everything. And then when I finally made my decision and telling coaches no, they weren't too happy, but... It comes down to what's best for me, so yeah. <laughs> okay, what what was the selling point, the Bayou Kokomo, that made the difference? It was just, it felt like home. I'm far enough away from home that I'm not around Richmond people, and I'm close enough that I can drive home on the weekends if I want to and miss my family. But I love their coach. I love how passionate she was about the game, and basically she's going to push me to be the best I can be, and it should be fun. <laughs> and that is, I mean, Bottom line is, I think it's good for athletes if they're in a certain community to get away and kind of experience something new. Is that also what you were looking for? Yeah, yeah. I was trying to get away, so yeah. <laughs> okay. What did they did they talk to you about position wise and, and anything like that, or did you guys keep it pretty much on the basics? Um, I will be playing point guard. I know that, and they're basically it's a whole new recruiting process. They just recruited eleven new players. There's only two coming back, so they're starting fresh basically. So I'm excited to be a part of the process. Did you think? Go back a couple of years ago and think that basketball, at least collegiately, would be in your future. Was that something you thought about at all? Oh, no, not at all. It was strictly soccer, but I found the passion and love for it again. So, yeah. Well what, well, what was the difference then? What made it better for you? You know, you had the injury situation your junior year, but then what made it so you had that passion to return that you want to play the game of basketball? I feel like one of the major things was the basketball team compared to the soccer team was more of a family. So it really made me want to come and work hard for them and for myself. So, yeah. All right, let's talk about academics now because that's another part of your future and what do you want to study and what it perhaps are you looking to do in the future? I like the criminal justice system. I don't know what yet, but yeah, if I go, when I go to IU Kokomo, they have that there, so Good. it's a great opportunity. Well, you got a lot of different avenues to go there. You're not thinking lawyer, are you? No, oh no. Yeah, we don't need <laughs> more lawyers. Hey, what, uh, what about just living away from home for the first time and getting a chance to do something different and and having the freedom and now ability to make the call yourself. Do you kind of look forward to that uh, challenge? Oh, yeah. It's going to be awesome. I'm excited not to have to ask my parents permission for anything. And be an adult, but I know it's going to be hard and I'm going to miss them, but it's going to be fun. <laughs> yeah. What do you do between now and then if they kind of give you an idea what they'd like to have you work on as far as your game and things like that? Yeah, they're actually going to give me a packet and I have workout things I need to do. And they do this really cool thing where before every game I have to drink a gallon of water and I have to keep the gallon of water with me, so I have to do that. And yeah, ball handling, shooting, a bunch of drills. So I'm at practice, but here. <laughs> Last thing, I know you got to get going, but just from a standpoint of your four years, at least basketball wise, they're over. You only have a few more months left of high school. Do you sit down sometimes, kind of reflect that it's all coming to an end here pretty soon? Yeah, it's pretty sad, actually. It went by super fast, but I'm excited for the next chapter in my life, and it should be fun.